We are getting new locations on the Blackout map. This has been confirmed and the image has been going around Twitter and the internet of a new map with new locations. Now, I made a video, I think it was Sunday or it might have been Saturday, talking about the fact that Von der Haar says that we are not just one map with one mode. We are more maps with more modes. And they're going to be thinking that maybe there's a new map coming. But with this update, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be getting some new locations. They're going to be breaking it down in today's video. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Here is the teaser map in question. As you can see, all the red areas that are highlighted indicate new zones. Anything else that's on the map is already there. All the red is new. And Let's be brutally honest here, straight up, there is a shit, a shitload of red on this map. So, as you can see, all the places that aren't so congested, so the Hydro Dam, the places near Turbine and all that good stuff, have been affected most with this update, which is, which is nice. Because not many people land at Turbine, not many people land at Hydro Dam. If you look in the top left hand of your screen, ladies and gentlemen, up where that big circle is, just to the right of that, where Estates normally is, there's some things being added there. And I can I can tell you, no one ever lands there. In fact, I'm 100% sure that if I went there, I could sit there for the entire game without a gun and no one would come to shoot me. It is that dead. So... There are new maps and new locations coming in this update. This update will be out on the 19th of February with this new operation. They're going to call it an operation, but really it's just like season three of Fortnite or season three of Blackout. It is exactly like that. Now, what's weird is everyone's been complaining for new areas to be added. You don't necessarily have to add areas to make the game seem more fresh. You can take away places and it has the same effect. Like I was talking about in the video that I spoke about earlier on in the video. You could imagine, imagine the whole blackout map nuked. You would change the dynamic completely without adding anything in. Now that would be incredibly difficult and what they're doing is probably a lot bloody easier. But my point is and what I'm trying to poke at is you don't need to add things to get the same effect as making the game feel fresher. It's going to feel fresher because there's change. And that's what everyone's looking for. Everyone's looking for a better change. And to be fair, I know I said in the last video that I'm not really bothered. Like, I'm enjoying the way the Blackout map is already. But after landing at the same spots all the time, it does actually end up becoming too repetitive. But ladies and gentlemen, there is more. There is more that I want to add onto this topic. I personally think that with the new locations of the map, that you should add in new game modes to Blackout. Imagine that. Oh, there's this new game mode with this new location. That would be sick. I think if they add with this new operation, add in a couple more locations, maybe even take a couple away, then it would be great. And if they could add in some new modes, perhaps something like Down But Not Out, or there was this uh, Submachine Guns Only mode, something like that, like a rushed blackout, that would be insane. And each time, the circle would land on each of the zones, and that would be like that throughout that mode. It won't land on Nuketown, it won't land on anything else. It would only promote the new areas of the map. If you don't watch YouTube and you don't keep up to date, like subscribing to me on my YouTube channel. Let me know, is there anything that you guys want to add or want to see taken away? I think personally, what they should do is they should obliterate all the places that aren't so congested and replace them with new, fresh things. And that's what they're doing here, sort of, but not to the degree or extent that I think people are going to start going to them locations constantly. It's going to be like Fortnite, something changed in the map. Two weeks later, no one landed there. It is it is like that. That When that China place, that Chinatown got added to Fortnite, it was just congested to shit. Like, to shit. Everyone landed there. After a week or two of it being in the game, absolutely no one landed there. Everyone tried to avoid it. So what I think they need to do is learn from Fortnite's mistakes. Adding in new places isn't necessarily the right idea. When that thing got hit with a meteor, was it Dust Depot? When that shit got hit with a meteor, every man and his dog landed there. And every man and his dog continued to land there. So, 
Uh, like I said earlier, maybe adding new shit isn't the right way to go about old ways. I think that's it. I'm in the wrong profession. I'm going to quit doing YouTube and I'm going to become a speaker. I'm going to become the next Nelson Mandela, the next Barack Obama, the next Mahatma Gandhi. Uh, yes, I've, I'm, I'm going to be the next Lord of Speaker. I'm going to inspire millions to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you already haven't. Anyway, that has been the video from me, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know if you agree with my ideas that maybe adding in new things can necessarily be wrong and taking away old things can necessarily be right. Let me know what you guys think and let me know if you're going to play Blackout with a new update and if you've quit playing at all because I know a lot of people have started playing this Apex Legends thing. I know, I, I know I'm know, i saying the thing like I don't know what it is. I uploaded it to my bloody channel. If you have stopped playing Apex Legend or Fortnite or any game that is a battle royale to Go back to Blackout because it's a new update. Let me know down in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys think of the video also while you're down there. And just say that I'm beautiful and that I'm the next Nelson Mandela, Mahatma Gandhi or Barack Obama. Or the Donald Trump. I, I tried doing a Donald Trump accent but I completely messed it up. If you are new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Drop a like if you did enjoy and leave all the comments like I said down in the comment section below. But I hope you are having a great day. And this is Sluki, and I'm signing out.